Hello folks, welcome to BISTtrainings.com. My name is Amit and today I am going to show you how to create revenue demographic report. It's part of our learning series called OBA Advanced Data Analytics. These are the basic reports and as we go further, we'll design more complicated reports. So before we proceed further, let's understand the requirement. Uh, the business user would like to see the revenue and number of order placed based on number, based on customer age and marital status. So in order to make it more meaningful, we drawn over here with the bubble chart. As you see in this example, uh, the biggest con revenue contribution done by married people and of age group in between 25 to 30. The, the size of the bubble talk about the revenue contribution with the combination of X and Y axis which talk about customer age and number of order plays. So married people contribute highest in terms of revenue and they also make in terms of number of order place, they place order in between 30k to 35k of age group 25 to 30. The second number falls for divorce of uh, second number is single sorry second number is single of age group in between 25 I mean in between here close to 22 to uh, 13 14 year people they place an order of 25 K okay. so this bubble chart draw talk about the whole study whatever user require with respect to them revenue demographic reports. Now let's draw this report and see how it happened. In order to create this report we are going to use an Oracle OBA sample report. I log into my sample report and start preparing. It takes a little time to populate your catalog. I create new report, new analysis. In this example, we are going to use subject area of sample sales. To know how to create sample sales subject area, please refer to our previous videos. I need information about customer, uh, customer marital status, which I can find over here. Customer age, customer age we can see over here. I would like to see customer age, customer marital status with respect to number of order placed and revenue contribution. So they all find under majors or a fact revenue and number of order placed, order count, number of order placed or order count. The default view is always as a tabular view but we don't want a tabular view so I delete this and add a new view, bubble chart, graph, uh, a bubble chart. Okay so We'll edit this and create a bubble chart. I would like the size of the revenue should be revenue. The size of the revenue or the size of the bubble should be determined by revenue. So bubble size I place revenue and number of order place would be my horizontal access and customer age is a major it's a attribute over here but in this example we want it to be considered as a major so I use an XY axis I use customer age with and number of bubbles will be determined by customer marital status I want to differentiate them by different color because all of them are displaying single color it may not be very meaningful so I add additional column over here I add the same column marital status twice and once we use for color and one we use for differentiating between your bubbles. Now I did once again and I drag and drop very color by customer marital status. Now this makes sense. I could see over here the, the highest revenue contribution done by married people of age group in between uh, 20, 20 to 35 and they place an order in between 30k to 35k. Right. This is how can how we can create Demo, uh, revenue demographic report with bubble chart. Thanks for watching today's video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to access more videos. In a subsequent video, we'll talk about more advanced data analytics report. 
Should you have any training and consulting requirement, please touch base with us. Our website is bisptrainings.com. Thank you.